want to come make some eggs? Oh, good boy, yeah! We're going to come do some cooking! Up yeah, yeah, yeah. Come to the side, brother! Are you hungry? You want to be big and strong? I never expected to be living outside of England. I never expected to have a child at this age. I never expected to have a two-bed home. Tasty eggs. And another one? Lovely. Maybe put some pepper? I'm originally from Surrey in England. I've been in Cape Town for four or five years now. And I met you and Elisa pretty much as soon as I landed here, which is kind of lucky for me. <laughs> I'm an ordinary township kid who uh, grew up in Koguletu, a musician by profession. It, no one took me seriously in the beginning until I actually got my first guitar and they were like, oh wow, you're actually quite good at this. Uh, maybe you should pursue it as a career. My life was just like an open book until I found someone to settle me down. It's like the biggest dream come true to me because my biggest dream was to have a family and I have a family right now. A hard part of the relationship was other people's reactions. Um, it's generally been really positive, but I mean, even still, after years of being together, other people aren't used to it still. I actually saw him first busking in, in open streets in Bree Street in Cape Town City. And it was quite scary having to get to know people and start all over again. But as soon as I got here, I think it was maybe when I was on the top of Tame Mountain, I was like, something feels like home here. I couldn't describe it. And I was like, this is where I'm meant to be. <laughs> After the first flat where we kind of met, and we just couldn't find somewhere secure to settle. And so it was very much just hopping for short term, and that was really stressful. We were lucky to be able to fall back on your family in Googs, that they would have us there even just on the floor to have a shelter, and that's what was really important. Yeah, I've come to cut today, man. What do you think I should choose, yeah? I think I like this one. It was whilst we were still in Googs, um, Whilst I just started studying at UCT, we uh, found out that I was pregnant and we panicked. I mean, it was sheer shock and confusion and that really secured our relationship. We found this place we're in now online. And when we came for the viewing, I was like, oh, I can't believe this is actually an option. It looks so nice. It was so open, light, airy, and it felt fresh. Yeah. Came at a time where we were, we were actually looking for a piece of mind uh, to settle us down. Um, so we were really lucky to find someone that has a garden and a garage and so much space around. When I get home, it's like I chill, relax. So I create at the back uh, to go on like uh, live on, on, on Facebook and Instagram, do shows. The place where I can, I can be myself. I, I don't have to hide from the world and, and no one's gonna judge me. That's what Rachel and, and Jasper gave to me, the place that I call home. Probably one of the boldest moves you can do, right? Is to just ditch your country, ditch your family, ditch your friends and try somewhere that you have no idea about. It's all a dream, really. I mean, we're really lucky. And I'm, I'm really grateful that this is the way it's panned out. So babe, what do you fancy for dinner? Ah, uh, noodles. Like usual, <laughs> princess, no. 